So guys, we get asked all the time, how much money does our lawn care business make in a day? I just speared TQ with the tripod. Well, we just lost them because now I gotta go to the hospital. <laughs> Anyways guys, so I'm gonna give you a price breakdown of each property, a rough price breakdown of each property, and then we'll add it all up at the end of the day to kind of see where our profits are at, where we had to spend some money, or if you wanna consider it your losses, we're gonna break it down and show you exactly how much money we make in the day in the lawn care business. So first and foremost, we're gonna start off here with a couple acre, $125 property. Remember I said rough. We can't give a leg up on the competition. So let's hop to it. This is something that is overlooked a ton in our industry, guys, and that is the drive time in between jobs. So us using the Element software, what it does is it takes our entire route for the day and it basically maps it all out for us and gives us the shortest distance between jobs. And what it'll do is take us to the furthest one first and then we'll work our way back towards the house so that at the end of the day, we're right there just around the corner most of the time. So make sure you guys are using a good software and uh, yeah, make sure you're staying on top of your game and make sure you're as profitable as possible. This is the only bi-weekly account that we have in our whole entire route. We no longer do bi-weekly. I only do this one because it's right next to the business and now they're included together, okay? So this one, bi-weekly, that one uh, every single week. Today, when we're mowing both of these locations, we're gonna be about 110 bucks. came right around the corner to a first residential for the day. This one right here is gonna be 65 bucks. Let's hop on. finishing up here this is what it looks like Sean's gonna move the truck out of the way so that Tyler can blow off the street a little easier for him so he's not blowing around the truck
we're at our i believe our biggest one of the day in the route and this is just a big residential it's probably about two and a half probably close to three acres here and uh this one's going to be our most expensive residential for the day as well this one right here is going to run about 175 bucks I'm not walking to the back to show you the stripe. You just gotta believe it's there. It looks good. <laughs> it's hot. Yeah, it is. Whew. Really, bro? It needs it. guys another residential done here this one is 55 bucks i believe it's our close to the lowest of the day we generally uh i did want to say as well uh, we like to stay 40 and above 40 is our drop gate fee and that's going to be pretty much for a dinky property guys something that's going to take us 15 20 minutes and uh it just fits our numbers and that's the thing i want you guys to understand is it has to fit your numbers your numbers are not going to be the same as ours and ours aren't going to be the same as yours and so on and so on everybody's numbers are going to be different everybody's overhead is going to be different so uh you got to take this all into account and i know some people say might comment and say you know ah, i'd do that one cheaper ah, i would do that one for this and that's perfectly fine From yesterday and then once we get to our finished route from yesterday because the day kind of got thrown off with that overgrown property I'll go ahead and stop it and then we can calculate exactly what we make in the day in the lawn care business now I wanted to reiterate guys this is gonna be completely different for everybody if you're just doing small cookie cutter lots you know 40 35 50 bucks whatever you're doing them for but you're knocking out 10 of them 15 of them a day you know yeah you can still do really good but everybody's area is going to be different typically here most of our properties are quarter acre and up uh, we don't get the small stuff like if you live in washington dc they have the little small fenced in front yards uh you know other bigger metro cities or whatever you want to call them uh you know they have a lot smaller yards so you can take advantage of that but uh yeah this is just to give you an example of what we we make in a day in lawn care 
that you can make money in lawn care. It's just simply you have to be willing to put in the hard work and you also have to advertise so that you can pick up tons of customers. Very nice, fellers. Landed it. Alright guys, so we're moving along here. This property is a $70 cut. So if you're keeping track, you got the numbers so far. We're not done just yet with our yesterday complete route. But whenever we get there here in just one minute, we'll kind of add it all up and talk real quick about it. But Tyler's laying down some beautiful stripes. Let's uh, go ahead and watch the rest of this mow. Right, guys so two more after this one and then yesterday's full route will be complete you're right here you're looking at a $65 lawn All right, guys, cleaning it off real quick. So uh, we got the landscape cleanup job next week here for her scheduled for next Friday. So I just wanted to walk through and make sure exactly what she wanted done. So some of the things she was wanting us to remove, I told her like, you know, the ornamental grasses right now, I wouldn't cut them down, uh, wait a couple months. I told her we can take care of that in the fall. Uh, mainly the tree has a ton of little stickers and little branches growing at the bottom. We're gonna clean that up, clean up around the rocks. Uh, tear all the thistle out, round these up over here. The mums up front are looking really good. All right, 
guys, so we got one more residential after this commercial property here. This commercial property roughly is going to be about $200. I want you guys to take into account, I can't give exact numbers just because that would not be smart as a businessman on my end to give exact numbers. So some of these numbers are a hair bit lower, some of these numbers are a hair bit higher. I'm just giving you guys an idea of a roundabout on prices. Last one here and we're gonna go ahead and add it all up and kind of give you a grand total of what you can possibly make you can make way more you can make a little bit less but the biggest thing is is that you're profiting and you're making money to take care of yourself your family all right guys so last one for yesterday's route now we're gonna continue on into today's route and this one here, roughly about a $65 yard. And uh, it's just basically a plain Jane corner and we have to trim the ditch every other week. So let's move on. 
So it's the end of the day. Like I told you guys, that was a little bit of a combination of yesterday and today because we did that big overgrown property. I did not anticipate that being in our normal daily route. So we went ahead and finished out this video because I had filmed the first part yesterday before we got to that overgrown property. And then uh, that kind of threw the things off. So I wanted to finish out this video specifically for you guys. So uh, if you added up all of those numbers, you came up with $1,005. Like I told you guys, I can't give you exact numbers, <clears throat> excuse me, but our grand total for the day was $1,120. That's what we actually made, okay? Now, to take into account all of our deductions, fuel for the day was roughly about 75 bucks. Employee cost is about 175. I'm not gonna give you exact numbers because uh, what we pay Tyler and what Tyler's compensated is nobody's business, uh, but roughly about 175 bucks. Uh, also, you know, mileage, wear and tear, this and that, I deducted another additional $50. Uh, there's a lot of things that go in there, insurance, uh, just everything, guys. So grand total, we're going to minus $300 off of our actual, which was $1,120. And let's go ahead and do that. $1,120 minus $300. We come up with... $820 guys so not a bad day whatsoever I will take that any day of the week so with that being said I want you guys to understand not every day is a $1,000 day even though we try to hit $1,000 every single day we have a day of the week where we hit almost $2,000 in that day and then we have another day of the week which will be Friday is our lowest day of the week and we'll probably do right around $650 to $750 somewhere around there uh, we do have to go back and finish that overgrown property so it's going to be a lot bigger this week it'll probably end up being about a, a $1,200 day so that's good and uh yeah we're going to see if we can get that lady a free mowing we're still working on that video over there like I kind of said if it hits 5,000 uh you know likes on that video yesterday we're going to go ahead and give it to her free and I know some of you are going to be like you know that's just to get us to hit the thumbs up button and like and uh honestly guys it doesn't matter uh, we want you to hit the like button and, you know, we want you to comment and that does drive the algorithms. And uh, that's just part of YouTube, you know, ads and all of that stuff is just part of YouTube. Uh, you can't expect anything in life for free and not even these videos. Uh, you know, we spend three hours a day, you know, editing, filming these and then uploading them for you. And you guys are a true blessing to our family, but we like to feel that we're a blessing to you as well. Uh, and we know we actually are because we get hundreds of messages a year from people saying, hey, you inspired me to start my business. Hey, you inspired me to start a side business from my job. And now I'm moving on to a full time business. And, uh, you know, that's the biggest thing here at Spencer Lawn Care is we want to be impactful. We want to be a positive, uh, you know, vibe that we're putting out into the community. And that's what it's always been since day one, whenever I started the channel back in 2014. We have like well over a thousand videos on this channel guys so if you take into account minimum two hours a day editing filming uploading which that's very minimum you know you can kind of do the numbers there of how much time and effort uh you know we've put into to growing this channel to where it is today and it's honestly a blessing to our family we do get compensated from youtube very well and it has absolutely 100 percent helped us better our lives we've never tried to hide that from anybody and we never would hide that from anybody but uh yeah i hope this video helps you guys out i hope it motivated hope it motivates some of you to uh, get out there and crush it and guys just know you can smack our numbers in the face you can do way better than this you could do a little bit under this but it's absolutely okay okay as long as you're running your business you're profiting you're making money you're investing and you're saving for those down months because winter's coming you're saving for those down months and you're not hurting anybody you're being an honest business owner and yeah, you can't hurt anything, guys. So I hope you really enjoyed this video. I enjoyed making it, even though it kind of got thrown off there a little bit. But as always, I got a cup of coffee here I need to drink before it gets uh, too uh, cold. <sighs> That's good. Keep mowing, keep growing, keep making money, boys. We'll talk to you later. TQ out. Peace. Bye. We love you guys.